we were talking about a boundary drought dk and that was going to be the big thing a big talking point had bangladesh gone on to lose which was the most probable outcome but what mehdi hasan did was he got the boundaries when it mattered and kept them in touch it was not that they just didn't find a run true i think uh, he batted very cleverly uh looks a very powerful player on the off side generally tailenders are good on the leg side but he is look somebody who looks to hit a lot more on the off side and got a couple of sixes but what was nice is towards the end of the over when he had to take a single he got into good positions to get that single you know just walking in taking the single on the leg side and then he played with the bowlers a bit got lucky a bit but uh, sometimes as a middle order batsman ask me and I'll tell you you do need a bit of luck Certainly, of course, there was that bit of luck, but just it it reminded one of a good old Test match where you're playing with number eleven. You want to prolong the innings as much as possible. Keep batting, farm the strike, five balls, take a single, keep going. Obviously, it was a situation like that where the re- required rate didn't matter. Yeah, but I think what happened is one he start hitting those couple of balls. He it freed him. You know, nine wickets down. He said, "I have to take some risk." So he gets a couple of sixes, gets the ball in the middle of the bat, and suddenly feels he can do it. Suddenly, you see 15, 20, 25 runs have gone, and the target is from 50 become 25, and that's when you start believing. In fact, that was a crucial part of the match. When you have 50 to chase, you're going to bat very freely because the odds are against you. But when you have 20 to chase, 15 to chase, that's when you think, okay, now I can win this match. And I think he handled that pressure beautifully. Yeah, I think that good point. I was going to come to that, and I think uh, Joy put it in perspective perfectly. At at 50 to get, you really you're, you're playing with with freedom. but when you start seeing the finish line a finish line that you shouldn't have seen at all i think that was the real test of the temperament for mehdi hasan and credit to the number 11 as well yes absolutely i think when the scoreboard is slightly far from your reach you tend to react differently and think to think differently because you got nothing much to lose but as the game proceeds on and you get closer to the target that's when the pressure starts mounting and that's when the big teams find a way to somehow get through that pressure to you and that's what didn't happen today yes they had a couple of opportunities both when a begging but you know credit where credit's due i think he still found a way i think personally that yes mehdi hasan probably batted well but india didn't bowl well in that partnership that's my honest thought they will go back into the dressing room and say if we look at the six victories that we've got this is one of the most special ones because it was way out of reach for us at one stage Definitely I think that's what makes this win very special for Bangladesh. I think considering they play 35 and lost 30, I think they somewhere at the back of their mind know that obviously every time they play against India it's a massive, you know, elephant on their back. But finding a way to win these ugly games just like what Joy said, those are important and that will give a lot of confidence in the team and that Mehdi Hasan showed. He has that dog fight in him. You can see he bowls those tough overs, bowls in the power play. and then comes back and bats and make sure he gets a job done so that was really good to watch we know how passionate their fans are and they definitely needed this we saw some faces when there was uh, when <laughs> the ninth wicket fell and we were almost feeling sorry for them no matter which side you were on no no absolutely i mean the bangladesh fans and virat kohli they are the most expressive characters in world cricket you know bangladesh fan virat you just have to see their faces and you know everything that's happened in the game and so many players Joy, were being said the pakistani the fan pakistani fans have Let's a different expression Pakistan. Pakistani fans actually have they're brilliant that when they look completely dejected they have a particular look which is but Bangladesh is like the expression goes from a to z in about 30 seconds if you see the ball in the air and they drop a catch you know